good scooter, everybody. It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. So, brothers, there is a very popular clip going on right now with a brother by the name of BK Brasco. And of course, this brother is talking about dating younger women. He doesn't like dating women his age because he feels like those women are not in shape. Those women are, are playing around. They're wasting time. They don't look as good. And of course, you know, in every part of the world, a, a lot of men are dating younger women. Just look at Jimmy Fox uh, in America. The girl must be half his age. Diddy dates women exclusively half his age. Now, the older women are saying, well, why don't you date women your age? And the guy goes out there and says something. I think a lot of guys have some level of cringe towards it and the way that he is saying it. But uh, 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 of course, you know, a lot of guys can possibly see some level of agreement with what he's saying, right? We know that um, some men, you know, uh, can find younger ladies attractive. Now, some brothers want a woman their age because of a level of maturity. Some brothers need a woman who, know, who knows uh, what she's doing, things like that. You know, whatever. We all we all get it, all right? And um, so you have this sister who basically uh, Amin, uh, Amanita talks, right? And, and, and I want to just play this clip here, and then I'm going to come back. Date somebody your own age. Why aren't you doing Why? that? Why? Why aren't you dating women your own age? W some women. Not all. I get, not all. Some women be pretty when they're young. When they get older, they be looking bad. There's the older women don't dynamic. be fit. They don't be friendly. They, they don't be, be feminine. <laughs> they don't be cooperative. So men and, their, and they don't be submissive. Are, they a be, lot of times yo, men want to date somebody so much younger because y'all be wanting somebody to train. That's what yeah, it is. Yeah, sometimes. And, and men say that. Hey, they, uh, hey. Women are not things to train. Uh, well, you could train, train up. It's a they train up a child the way they should go. But that's, that's why y'all be wanting to date children. <laughs> no, but That's why no, y'all be wanting to date children. Look, so listen. I see older guys date young girls all the time. You, you understand? We do, but that doesn't say that there's nothing wrong with that, though. Just because it's normalized does not mean that it's okay. So I want to play the second clip of the young lady clapping back at what he was saying, and then we're going to check it out. I ain't letting no old <laughs> suck the life out of me. No, I'm not doing it. Why? You want to hold around in your 20s and your 30s. Now you're 50 and you're single because you was holding around all around town, community d and now you want to get somebody that's younger because they less used. You're used. So you're used up and you want somebody less used up. No, go ahead and get your match. They be out here. They be having several baby mothers, several kids, but want a girl with no kids. No, get your match. All right. Now, she's saying that she won't date an older guy because she don't want no guy sucking the life out of her. I mean, I mean, uh, she, she's a, a very attractive young lady, too. But again, you know, uh, women can say whatever they want to say on uh, on the podcast. I don't know if that, that's what she really believes, but she said it, I believe it. Um, now, when was coming after this guy talking about how he looked talking about he got a beluga belly and all of this and the train up the child and the way he should go and it's rooted in pedo talk and all of that and let me just say for for men like if if you believe this right and I'll, there are some people who believe like you know you're dating somebody younger whether you're male or female there is some level of training altering how they are to be with you there is some level of getting to um the level you need them to be. I think both people believe that because women who date younger men, which I'm sure she ain't got no problem with, would say the same thing. Here's what's gonna happen though. When you're a man and you say that somewhere publicly, they are gonna come after you. It's not worth even talking to them about it. Don't do it. Man gotta just like keep certain things to yourself, right? You want a younger woman? Do what Jimmy Fox do. Jimmy Fox got a younger woman, usually white. Do you think that Jimmy Fox will come out there and say what he wants? We all know that Jimmy Fox, for the most part, likes younger women white women we know that we know that with diddy we know what a lot of people al pacino we know that these guys all probably agree with this guy here they're not gonna come out and say it women know that all right a lot of guys who have money and have opportunity are probably not gonna date women their own age simply because of the women might not be as malleable towards a man's liking or the woman could already have been dealing with a man before and you know she is uh traumatized by a, a guy so that's another reason too. It, it, I won't even say it's so much of a looks thing, but if you've been around, you know, uh, some toxic guys before, and you know you just can't change your ways, 
that's another reason. But whatever the reason is, don't even tell them. Like, live your life. A lot of men got to just stop going to these podcasts and talking about, like, how they feel about what they want to do. You want a younger woman that you feel that you can have more influence over her life or how she treats you, fine. Long as she's adult, fine. But why are you going to say that and mess up your opportunities? Like, a lot of black men got to be, you know, like I said, there is not even no, it's not even worth going on here talking about this. Because they're going to take that one clip out and get you. Just do what everybody else do and go live your life. They will notice. Damn. He only likes, you know, young, young women. He's 50. All the women he, he deals with is uh, uh, 26. If they're upset about it, that's their problem. But you don't waste your time going telling them. Like, men got to understand because you have money opportunity, you can't be out here just talking about things like that. You know, talking about, you know, listen, you know, we live in a society now, man. Okay. We all know that obesity is a problem in the black community. We all know that, right? We all know that a lot of women uh, can have weight issues. We know that. Here's the problem. You don't have to go and tell nobody that. You know, I used to, you know, like before, like, yo, man, a lot of these chicks is like, like this or whatever. They got these weaves. Man, you know, why don't they wear their natural look? All right, look, y'all do whatever y'all gonna do. Like, seriously, I got things to do today. <laughs> I have places to be today. So I'm not even worried about whatever y'all do. God bless you. You know, I see women all the time that are that are not my type. I see women that are my type. And guess what? It's not my job to go and tell them what I, I, I like and what I don't like and what because it, it doesn't matter. I'm worried about what I'm trying to do. Right. So let me continue to worry about what I'm doing. You know, a lot of men that just be so much better. Stop into stop telling these women about themselves. That's something that we got to stop doing as men like. I, 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 sometimes I used to be like in arguments, like I would hear debates, women and men dating and stuff, whatever, even here in Uganda, I don't even get involved in that at all. No more. I just don't care because number one, I got money to go make talking to your ass is not going to help me do nothing. And it's not going to change anything. Anyway, you're still going to be just as silly as you were before I started. I don't, I don't argue with feminists no more. Even guys. And I look, y'all do that all day. I got somewhere to be. Okay. God bless you. It's good to see you. Thank God for you. Let me get to the money or to where I'm supposed to be at, which is hopefully away from you. Okay. Stop telling these women that they're out of shape. Stop telling these women that, that, that they, that they, they, they got all these kids. Now, if we want to talk about it as a societal issue as men, that's one thing, but stop telling these women about themselves, man. Stop telling them that they already know because other women have told them already. Why do you need to tell them? Don't tell them nothing. That's the main thing. Like we, we need to stop trying to teach them something. Folks already done told them already. Kevin and told them, they mama and told them, they granddaddy didn't told them, they friends tell them. They know they got a problem. Some of them. They are well aware of it, whether they want it. You think you, somebody they don't know, don't pay their bills, is going like, they're going to listen to you? No. So stop engaging them. Don't go to the podcast talking about that. Look, older women, hear what you're supposed to say. Older women are great. You know, they bring some experience to the game and, um, you know, some of them look nice. You know, some people can look nice. Some people look better than others. But hey, I'm open to dating anybody. Just just if you don't want to date them, just say something nice about them. God bless them because here's some older ones that are sexy. Right. And let's move on with the conversation. Women know that men like younger women. Every woman knows that you don't have to tell them that. Just like if a woman got a big butt. Do you got to tell her she got a fat butt or do she know it? Oh, you got, you got, you got, you got a nice, uh, 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 top there. You think that she don't know that you sexy Think she don't know that. And if she ain't sexy, you think she also don't know that so you go up there and tell her like, Oh, you know what? You so out of shape. I mean, what, <laughs> what's the, po what is the point? Leave them alone. You know, don't, don't cut your bag off and your opportunity from trying to correct them. You, men should talk to men about women. If you want to do that, fine, go ahead and do that. But just talking about like you don't want to date them, and I guess it don't make, it don't make no sense. Now, if they want to talk to you about who they don't want to date, let them do it. What, what, who cares? Let's get to the money. So, guys, what do you think? It's your boy O'Shea Duke Jackson back at it again with another episode of the Celebrity Junk. Preacher for you, just heard a bell. We're out.